combat rescue officer is the team commander for uh, pararescuemen, but also as they advance through their career, they are going to be mission commanders and they're going to be deployed squadron commanders and then also squadron commanders back home. A combat rescue officer who's the team commander, he's always thinking up and out. He's planning three steps ahead of how are we going to infill into this target? How are we going to exfill? While your team leader, the senior PJ, is more focused on down and in. So he's looking at the rest of the PJs, how the security posture is, and he's planning all the tactical stuff as well. And they're working together to be one team. Crow Phase 2 was implemented back in 2001. It's a screener, so we are screening potential candidates for our career field that we see as a low risk for us. It is being implemented because we have seen about 95% of candidates that are selected are able to pass the entire pipeline to make it through to get their beret and graduate. That's the reason why we've been able to implement it. If we have went away from that, you'll see a lot lower attrition rate or a lower percentage for that.